Hey guys, my name is Acharita. This is Film Companion. You're watching Not a Movie Review, and right now I'm not going to be reviewing Fan. What's the star? Not here. The new one. So I have good news and bad news. Manish Sharma's Fan, as the title in the trailer suggests, is a story of a guy who's obsessed with a superstar, and his one big dream in life is to hug his favorite actor, Aryan Khanna. It's all very high re jabra, ho re jabra, cutie for duty, until said fan, Gaurav Channa, legit loses his head. Obsessive fans के बारे में हम सब ने सुना है. There's a man in Lucknow called Visharu Khan who quite possibly is the inspiration behind the idea of fan. I mean, for real. Take a look at his house. What? And that guy who entered all kinds of events and parties and even took selfies and stuff because he looks like Bradley Cooper. हाँ, but ये वाला थोड़ा क्री क्री है. Spurned and heartbroken, Junior Aryan Khanna, Gaurav Channa, fan. Infiltrates every part of Aryan Khanna's life. घुस जाता है मतलब अंदर अंदर घुस जाता है. And how the real Aryan deals with this, ये आपको पिक्चर देख के पता चलेगा. All right, the good news. The prosthetics, 3D imaging, scanning, CGI, whatever has gone into making Shah Rukh Khan look like a 25-year-old is on point. Oscar-winning makeup effects artist Greg Chanum worked with Shah Rukh Khan for this film, and most recently Rishi Kapoor for Kapoor and Sons. मतलब पता चलता है तीन ऑस्कर्स क्यों मिले हैं. Mummy must be so proud. The next good news, Shah Rukh Khan is back. Badiya acting hai yaar, bahut hi badiya. He's playing a convincing 25-year-old and a 50-year-old superstar. Sometimes in the same frame together. The body language, the slightly off dancing, the different kinds of running even yaar. Ek insaan do alag-alag tarikhe se bhaag kaise sakta. First tell me this. Ugly good news. Bhai, the first half of the movie is superb. The characters have been established beautifully without really saying, oh, ye dekho, ye Delhi ka ladka hai and everything. Legendary actor Sachin Pilgaonkar sir's daughter Shreya is making her debut in this film and future bright. I mean, papa ki jeans mili hai. Very good. Ah, bad news. The second half. The second half is the bad news. At one point, Aryan Khanna decides to take matters into his own hands and literally chases Gaurav Chanda down lanes and above rooftops of a Croatian town and parkours the shit out of that place. I was like, okay, let's go, it's okay. I mean, he's Aryan Khanna, but he's a pampered and delicate movie star and not Captain America's sidekick. I was like, let's calm down, please. There are a lot of cat and mouse type chase sequences in this picture. There's a little don't do wally feeling. Which doesn't come to anyone. Never. Things really take a turn for the bizarre, yeah. When the super realistic dances at weddings movie star turns into a super non-believable vigilante. He runs, fights, chases, bleeds and still has it in him to give a 70-minute Chuck the India-esque speech in the climax because Shah Rukh Khan. Also, there's no song in the film. There's that one Jabra fan song which I really like. So, I think it's more than 1.5kg orchestra in the background score. It's distracting and at certain places reminded me of Harry Potter. Everything reminds me of Harry Potter. But watch this movie, you must. It's a good story, good storytelling even, good Shah Rukh Khan. But just make sure you have the patience to, well, sit patiently through the second half. I mean, I'm exhausted, yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, fan is that 2,000 rupees ka full body massage you get, no? It's refreshing to begin with, but by the end of it, you're just like, I'm going to finish, just please. Go to the house. It's done. This thing makes it look like I've got the first prize in the Ramli La Maidan, my first prize in the VIP. Now you are first, come on, subscribe to Film Companion to get your film fix. I like it.